We surely didn't see this one coming. As you have it, Melbourne United's well-known and fan favorite Jack White has landed himself a two-way deal with the Denver Nuggets. For all Melbourne United fans, this isn't much of a surprise. The star forward has definitely been aiming for such an achievement for a while now. Let's jump right into the details. But first, a reminder about our brand new giveaway. We're giving away a PS5 with a copy of NBA 2K22 and Madden 22. All you have to do is watch the full video, leave a like, comment the keyword hidden in the video, and make sure you're subscribed. It's that simple. First up, Jack White's much-anticipated NBA signing. ESPN's Adrian Wojnarowski announced the good news, and it took the Melbourne United fandom by storm. For White, it's been an amazing few months, and he's been making waves, helping the team snag the MBL 22 minor premiership, along with his first Australian Boomer selection, and now his first NBA contract. Several giant feats in succession, and there's no denying his performance in the NBA Summer League is what helped him snag a contract with the association. Recently, while speaking to Melbourne United Media, White expressed how playing for the NBA, the top league in the world, was his lifelong dream. This contract, hence, gives him the perfect opportunity to take further steps towards living out said dream. And the star forward is beyond grateful to the Denver Nuggets for giving him a chance. White has now become part of the group of Melbourne United players that have progressed into the NBA, like Jock Landau and his championship teammate, Joe Luau Achul Jr. and Udai Baba, the NBA Summer League players, to name a few. And the club is nothing but proud for their forward for signing in the NBA, with CEO Nick Trulson speaking of the joy felt by the organization. Now for Nick Trulson's kind words about his star forward. Trulson expressed the club's observation of the staggering amounts of hard work put in and the talent the player has, saying that being signed with the NBA always seemed to be a real possibility for him, considering his dedication to the game, especially after he was selected to play in the Summer League. Trulson went on to say that as a person, athlete, and player, Jack White is incredible all around, and with this opportunity in the NBA, he will excel even further. The club looks forward to seeing what he will achieve, though of course, this change would alter the dynamic of the NBL 23 roster. But Trulson reassured his audience that along with Dean Vickerman, the pair have devised a plan for this upcoming scenario. Currently, preoccupied with watching the NBA Summer League, of course, they will thoroughly miss White, or Whitey as they call it, at the club this season. But in his absence, they will also be able to make contesting for the NBA their main focus by putting together necessary pieces that would give them the best opportunity to take the next step towards it. Trulson ended his statement by reiterating how Melbourne United prides itself for being a destination club for both local and international players, aiming to help these talented athletes unlock their full potential and become the best versions of themselves, increasing their chances to reach the NBA. This will always be the main focus of the organization. Melbourne fans, on the other hand, are still on the edge of their seats for the club's announcements, since there's still a bunch of players left to join the MBL 23 roster. The release of the MBL 23 MBL schedule is yet to come. Next up, a little background. It's no surprise that Jack White seized the first opportunity he got, i.e. the Summer League, to bag himself a two-way NBA contract with the Denver Nuggets. After all, the former Melbourne United forward and Duke graduate left no crumbs when stuffing the stat sheets with incredible scores in back to back games for the Denver Nuggets. And this was despite the fact that he joined the tournament later than the rest because of his national team commitments. In store for White, the next season has him spending his time mostly with Grand Rapids Gold, the Nuggets G League affiliates, and exactly 45 days with the NBA squad, all as a part of the two-way deal. And everyone seems to be as ecstatic about this change as White is himself. Boomers coach Brian Gorgian stated how White possesses all the traits a coach could ask for in a player, and his position in Denver will be highly beneficial to the team. According to him, White has an extremely high basketball IQ, and Gorgian hence holds him in the highest regard. White was also coached by Mike Krzyzewski while playing with Zion Williamson and Jason Tatum during his four-year college career, both of whom are NBA stars. Then he won an NBL title with Melbourne United in 2011 and managed to overcome a serious Achilles injury. Now he will be the third new face in the NBA from Australia after draftees Dyson Daniels and Luke Travers both of whom were selected by the New Orleans Pelicans and the Cleveland Cavaliers at this year's draft selection. We also have Aaron Baines and Matthew Delavadova currently pushing for returns. Now for White's performance in the Summer League. We've all heard of the saying, be defined by your comebacks, not your setbacks. Well, Jack White is the personification of this saying. What with him completing an incredible turnaround a mere 18 months after his Achilles injury ended his rookie NBL season and has now picked up a whole NBA contract. That's a comeback 
back for the history books. When playing for Denver in the summer league, White left no complaints with his incredible performance, averaging eight points on 70% shooting, 6.5 rebounds, 1.0 steal, and 1.3 blocks in 16.3 minutes per game. He didn't so much as break a sweat. Instead, he put his best foot forward and scored eight points, three blocks, 15 rebounds, and a steal and two assists, all in his first standout game against Cleveland. Next, he put up 14 points, five rebounds, two steals, and an assist and a block against the Clippers, leaving no doubt around his value on both sides of the court. Needless to say, it's no surprise the NBA wasted no time in signing him up. It's been only a year and a half since White's career was put on hold after sustaining his Achilles injury. Now the player is NBA bound, and he acknowledges that it's his own resilience that has let him make such a drastic rise in such a short time. The player commented on his ability to be able to bounce back stronger than ever, especially after his injury, while speaking to the News Corp before his last game in the Summer League against the Utah Jazz. And the people closer to him see his improvement since his college days at Duke, especially now that he's recovered from his injury. Adding to that, White's experience on the court. White is more than experienced when it comes to the big stage. The star forward has four years of college under his belt at Duke, coached by the legendary Mike Krzyzewski, and playing around Zion Williamson, Jason Tatum, R.J. Barrett, Marvin Bagley III, Grayson Allen, Luke Kennard, Wendell Carter Jr., Harry Giles, and Cam Reddish, all of whom are infamous NBA stars. This experience helped mold White into a more complete player, according to the star himself. He explained how challenging himself against players as great as the ones he played with helped him get better as a player himself. Though the NBL is an entirely different ballpark with grown, experienced athletes, the athleticism isn't the same, but the environment definitely makes the game way different than what he's used to. That being said, the forward expressed that he does have more athletic freedom here than he did there. So for him, finding a good balanced medium between the experiences he had with the players he played with in college versus the players he is now with is imperative for his performance. Not only has it made him a more balanced, complete player, but he can also look at the game in different ways, giving him a more objective point of view. Last but not least, White's thoughts on the Summer League. The star forward interestingly described the Summer League as an ocean of basketball players doing their best to achieve their dream and make it work. He stated that all the players are competing for a job, playing to be able to make an earning for themselves. The harsh reality of the Summer League is that the players have families to support and tables to put food on, so it's not just a passion that's making them play as hard as they do. The player observed that the unpredictability of being a professional athlete really shows when playing at the Summer League in particular. White's own journey of hard work and resilience is one that serves as an example, best noted by his manager, Sammy Wallazachowski, who celebrated White's achievements on Twitter, marking the 471 days of work he's had to put in while congratulating him on making the best comeback. And we're just as proud of him, considering that this has been his lifelong aspiration as far as his junior days in Terelgan, his hometown in regional Victoria, Australia. And that's a wrap for this video. What do you think of Jack White signing with the Denver Nuggets? Do you think this is a well-deserved achievement? Let us know down in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one.